What's up, y'all? Thanks for tuning in. It's your boy TD back again with another video. And as you guys can see from the title of the video, this is not a trucking vlog. There's actually a couple of things that I wanted to address. Um, and so this video is just that. So half of you that are subscribed to me already know what happened and know who I'm talking about in the title of my video. And the other half of you don't. So let me catch you up to speed. He documented his entire journey from the very beginning of his employment with Schneider. Recently, Bobby Reach was let go from Schneider. And one of the reasons that Schneider gave Bobby for why they were letting him go was because of him doing what we have been doing since the beginning of this channel. Recording while driving. They gave him another reason why they were letting him go and that other reason was because of something that he did in one of his videos. Now I'm not going to go into detail as to what that is. If you guys want to look into it, I'll be putting a link to his channel in the description below so you guys can check that out. But yeah, he ended up doing something in one of his videos that Schneider did not like at all and that was when a rock got stuck in between his tires. Uh, it wasn't necessarily the rock getting stuck in between the tires. It was more of what had happened afterwards. And again, I'm not going to go over that. You can go to his channel and check it out. But because of that, and the fact that he's been recording while driving, just like we do, uh, Schneider let him go. Now, I just have to say, Bobby and I know each other. I consider Bobby a friend at this point. And I just have to say, I've talked with him off camera he's a genuine person he's got a really good head on his shoulders he has a great mindset he's a very intelligent human being and behind the scenes he knows what he's doing now, I just gotta say it's it's really unfortunate that he was let go from Schneider and behind the scenes some things I don't necessarily agree with so Schneider has an electronic use policy and the verbiage that they use within their electronic use policy pretty much goes along the lines of you are not allowed to use your phone while driving you're not allowed to text you're not allowed to be on a phone call and you are not allowed to record now Bobby and I talked about that and we noticed that the way the verbiage was written made it sound like they didn't want us holding a camera and recording while driving or holding our phone and recording while driving. The verbiage didn't include hands-free camera usage. And so we personally thought we found a loophole or a gray area for being able to record and vlog while we drive. This is literally what I use to mount the GoPro to my head while I talk to you guys and drive. It's completely hands-free and my GoPro is voice activated. All I have to do is tell it when to start and to stop and it'll start and stop. And so by doing that, definitely thought that we were okay, but I guess we were wrong. And so now that the electronic use policy has been pretty much highlighted and bolded and underlined and italicized, we now have a clear picture as to what's acceptable and what isn't. And vlogging while driving isn't one of those things that are acceptable. Now that brings up what I wanted to talk to you guys about. In light of the recent events, I don't think I can continue vlogging. And here's the thing, I genuinely enjoy the vlogging aspect. It makes time go by. It definitely helps me cope with the loneliness of being on the road and being away from my family. And again, just to remind you guys, before I joined Schneider and became a truck driver, I enjoyed making videos. And here's the thing, this isn't me saying goodbye. I'm not gonna stop making content on this channel. We just have to be creative and change it up. And I know, a lot of you guys are probably thinking, why did you just tell on yourself? <laughs> you could have pretended like you didn't know Bobby. You could have pretended like you didn't know he got fired. You could have pretended that you didn't know that you couldn't record while driving. I, I get it. I'm coming clear on video simply because of the fact that if I were to keep going and being able to make content like that and Bobby got fired for it, that wouldn't sit well with me at all. And I know I could have just pretended like I didn't know what was going on and just keep making content. But that's not how I roll. It would be extremely unfair if I just kept going and making content and doing what got Bobby fired and me being okay and still keeping my employment. And so that's why I'm 
coming to you guys with this video to make things right because I feel like this is fair. If he can't make vlogging content while behind the wheel, then I guess I can't make content vlogging behind the wheel either. Seeing a buddy of mine get let go because of doing what we love, it's a real eye opener. Honestly, I'm extremely grateful for the opportunity that I was given to be able to drive these trucks and get paid to go around and explore. That's something I've always wanted to do. Always wanted to get in a vehicle and just drive and see the United States. And now I'm getting paid to do that. But what I also wanted to do was be able to vlog that. And uh, we can't really do that anymore. At least with the company that we're with right now. And so with respect to Bobby Reach and with respect to Schneider's electronic use policy, uh, we're gonna have to change the way we do things. And uh, this officially ends the vlogging on this channel, as long as I'm with Schneider. And I still have a couple of days worth of content from before this point. And so I'm going to be taking those videos, putting them together, and I'm still gonna be uploading those. So you guys still have a couple of days worth left of content. And I hope you guys can respect my decision on how I decided to approach this situation. I just gotta do what's right, and I feel like by me approaching everything this way, I feel like that's the right thing to do. This is definitely not a video that I want to make, but I feel like I owe it to you guys. You guys have been awesome with following along with this journey of mine, and I just feel like I owe it to you guys to let you guys know what's going on behind the scenes. And so for as long as I'm employed with Schneider, from this point forward, we are no longer going to be vlogging. In the future, if I end up parting ways with Schneider and, uh, end up driving with a company that can help me with my personal growth within the truck driving industry and they let me record then that's when we'll get some vlogging content back again but for now i gotta do what's best for me and my family and that's gain all the experience that i can from schneider and put food on the table for my little man and my fiance at home but anyways guys thank you so much for watching again i appreciate every single one of you and uh i hope from here on out i still get to see your awesome comments and have awesome conversations with you guys thanks for watching this video guys sorry i had to deliver such bad news but it is what it is baby like i've said before you can't have the good days without first going through the bad <laughs> we just got to stay positive about the situation and uh move forward because things will definitely get better anyways y'all you know what time it is your boy Tiki is out. Peace.